35 years old uh, with our marriage. Do you still wait for your true love? Um, I gotta say that if I'm still single, uh, by the time I turn 35, I'll still wait for my other half. Because, um, you know, getting married to someone whom you do not love is really miserable. Mm -hmm. um, you may end up parting ways or even getting a divorce. Um, but on the other hand, um, for those who still decide to you know, just go ahead and get married, uh, it's completely justifiable mm -hmm. because some people cannot stand being alone. So who will pay for the wedding cost? Uh, men or women or both? Uh, actually neither. It's their parents who finance the wedding. Mm -hmm. Um, you know, it's kind of the norm in Vietnam because most young couples are still trying to make ends meet, yeah. so they cannot possibly afford the prohibitive costs of weddings. What did you think is the best age to get married? Well, it kind of depends. Um, some people, they may think that the optimum age to get married is around their mid-twenties because they want to avoid the generation gap between them and their kids. Mm -hmm. But on the other hand, there are also those who decide to tie the knot when they're a bit older. Um, so for example, like 35 to 40 years old, because they want to prioritize their careers. Um, it's quite reasonable, I think, because you know it's really hard to earn a living with, um, you know, if you have uh, parental duties. Do you think Vietnamese wedding wastes a lot of money? Absolutely, I think Vietnamese people love lavish weddings. Um, I think they're willing to splurge on things like decoration and food and invitations, you know, in order to show off their wealth to the guests. Do you think a man should take care of their babies and wash the dishes? Um, you know, traditional Vietnamese thinking dictates that women are in charge of like chores and child rearing. Um, you know, however, nowadays the responsibilities are kind of shared between the two spouses. So, you know, because gender equality is championed in most societies nowadays, we are seeing more men, you know, doing things like cleaning and cooking, and women also, you know, help bring home the bacon. Đôi khi những từ vựng hay nhất không phải là những từ vựng phức tạp, mà nó là dạng không phổ biến của những từ phổ biến. Mình ví dụ nhé. My parents financed this whole wedding. 